Hello again YouTube and I'm back with another video here and in this video um, I went through my bank recently and uh, I discovered that I had a bad nickel iron cell and uh, just kind of showing you looking at it right now um, I had a bad cell and what happened was it was shorted and so yeah it's on the warranty but I figured it's like you know I don't really want to I don't want to deal with you know waiting for a year or dealing with the distributor or anything like that I just felt like I'll just you know I want to see what it what it's about anyway um, and typically when you buy these cells like in a 24 volt uh, battery bank um, they give you 20 cells and but you only put 19 so there's one that's a spare so I use my spare so I checked the rest of the cells and you know they're fine it's just that I had one that was in the bad in the bunch and it was shorted and you know looking at it this is what the cell looks like this is what the cell looks like okay um you know this is the uh a positive plate right here and the negative plate looks pretty much like the same but you know there it just you can see that it's a different color right there so that's the iron and this is the nickel and you know the thing is you know looking at it you know I would have to say, after looking at both the Edison style and looking at these styles, I have to say that, you know, to be honest, that the Edisons are, they, they're, the quality is a lot better. I'll, I'll, you know, and with these cells here, you can see that, you know, there is no bolts to take apart. You can't take apart this cell. Um, I mean, it, it's, you know, there's some dividers like right there that, that divides it. The, the plastic dividers, I think are a good, you know, I like that, that approach. Um, it's just, you know, they're thick enough to keep these cells a, a, apart and uh, looking at it, you can see that they're welded. This is, this is how the cell is put together. You know, it's welded. Um, they're welded together and they're separated by plastic. Now, where, what happened was I actually found out where, found where the problem was. There was a short between the, this, these two plates. And what happened is, you know, it seems like the, uh, the nickel was, the nickel plate was bulging at the bottom. It's, it's almost like it, it kind of split right there. And it was like kind of bulging out. So I think that's what, that was, that was uh, what was causing my short. Now, I essentially, I believe I've repaired this cell, uh, but you can see that the design, uh, you know, as far as being put together is totally different, um, you know. Uh, you know, this is what because I, I rinsed it out and so forth like that. So I need to get it back into some uh, KOH real quick. But anyway, this is this is the cell from China, and I have to say that the Edison cells are a lot better quality um, by far. But you know, these things they do work, okay? Uh, but I, you know, I'm gonna be honest. <laughs> You know, the, the cells from uh, the, the uh, Edison cells are, they have a, a lot more uh, better quality. Uh, but anyway, you know, and the thing is I wanted folks to see and wanted folks to know that, uh, you know, hey, when there's something going wrong with your battery bank or there's something, up, you know, and you want to make a decision whether or not you want to go with these cells here, yeah, I want to give you all of the information, good and bad. So, you know, out of the 19, or, or I'm sorry, out of the 20 that I received from China, uh, one of them uh, evidently is bad, or was bad. I didn't check it when I first got the cells. Um, you know, to be honest with you, I didn't have enough knowledge to, you know, essentially to check to see uh, whether or not there were some shorts. You know, like right now, I've got, you know, I've got my uh, multimeter set for you know continuity, and you can see you know when I put up when I put the two leads on the terminals there's there is a you know there's some resistance there and uh, so there is no uh, there is no short anymore, and what I had to do was essentially where the short was was occurring which is down there I got again some of this mesh material and I kind of wrapped it around the uh, divider and just slid it back into place. Um, you know, and that, and, and then basically when I squeeze it together, when I put it back inside of the, uh, of the container, then it won't be a short and, and I, I'll put the cell back into service. Um, you can repair it with a little ingenuity, obviously, but the thing is, you know, it's not like you can take it apart, uh, because again, they're welded 
the, the, the plates are welded uh, to, the, to the terminals. And so that's, that's just not gonna happen. But anyway, all right, you two. And, uh, you know, if you have any questions, comments, or whatever, you know, feel free um, to, you know, uh, everybody's comment is valid, uh, you know, as long as it's civil. Um, but, you know, but other than that, you know, hey, I just want everybody to know, hey, I did run into at least one bad cell. Um, I believe I got this cell was, was bad when it was delivered. And, uh, you know, I just didn't, I didn't have enough, uh, you know, I just didn't, uh, I just didn't touch, I mean, a test for continuity or for short when I got them. So if you get, you, bottom line is you get any one of these nickel cadmium or nickel iron cells, ch check the cells to make sure that they're not shorted um, when, upon arrival. Um, you know, just check to see. Yeah, and this was under warranty, but as I said, you know, as opposed to waiting a year for a replacement or, or fighting with the distributor or anything like that, I said, you know, I essentially said, you know, hey, I'll just take it apart because I want to see what it's made of anyway. And if I can repair it, fine. If I can't, you know, I'll just look at it as a loss. But the thing is, I believe I've repaired the cell, so I'm good. All right. All right. Take care, YouTube. Okay, YouTube, I've repaired the damaged cell. And uh, you can see where, you know, red marks the spot there. But I uh, repaired the damaged cell, and it's back in the bank. And, uh, you know, it's holding a charge, and it's no longer shorted. So uh, it's repaired. Uh, <clears throat> so good to go there. So just wanted to show you, you know, the follow-up that, uh, yeah, even these, you know, are repairable to some extent. Uh, so, you know, I'm good to go. All right, take care, YouTube.